Good morning, everyone. I hope this finds you well, and I hope you're getting on okay with your live lessons and your remote learning. So I'm just putting together this quick video to show you how you can upload homework once you've actually done it. And it's pretty straightforward onto class charts. So if we take a look, this is what you'll see when you first log on to class charts. And if we go down to homework, you'll see your homework's broken down uh, by to do, completed, etc. I'm going to click and expand the to do at the top that's there and I can see everything that's kind of happened for me so far. If I have a look here, I can see that Mr. Bate uh, that sent me some home learning uh, last week. So I'm going to click on that arrow and box to the left hand side of it and that's going to bring up the homework concerned. So down at the bottom, we can see the documents that he has put on there to help you do your homework. And if you look right at the bottom, there's an orange button which says upload attachment. This is where you attach any work that you've done for that homework. So if I click on it, you can attach up to five documents. And if I go on to, well, let's go onto my desktop. Let's just find a file that I can click on there. And then I click on open. That's going to upload it. Okay. And once it's uploaded safe, you'll actually see that it's come there and you'll see that there's a, a delete icon if you've uploaded the wrong file by mistake. What's really important is that once you've uploaded everything and you've completed that homework is check the completed box at the top. And that tells Mr. Bate that you have done everything for that particular homework. You can also do the same on your phone. So here I've gone into class charts. If I click on homework across the top, I can see all my homeworks laid out as they were on the desktop. Click on to do, go down and find Mr. Bates lesson. There we are. OK. And on this time, if I click on upload attachment, I can either upload a photo or take photo and video. And that's quite a useful one if you just want to, if you've written something down. So I've got some homework I've done here. I can just take a photo use that photo and that will upload it automatically from my phone. So my phone's also a good way of being able to do that. And again, don't forget to check that completed button as well. So that's pretty much it for how you upload homework onto class charts. Any questions, reach out to your teachers or to your tutors.